Oh god. Ah! Kill it! Kill it! Oh! 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 See? Ninja spiders, man. Holy crap -o. What's up, YouTube? Six here, and welcome to Minecraft Feed the Beast. Now, the only time I have ever played Minecraft was for Pixelmon, so this is going to be a little bit of an experience for both of us. I do know the one thing I need to do is build a freaking house before it's dark out. So, on that note, I do need. To, I was messing around just to get an understanding of the controls. Ooh, I got some sand. So, I do know I need to get some food. I have these mushrooms that I don't seem to be able to eat yet. So, I'm gonna get some wood. And you get wood from the trees. So, let's see here. Wood. Getting wood, yeah. For an achievement, getting wood. <laughs> okay, so... What we want to do is we want to build some tools first so that we can easily... Just like any other survival game, you need tools so that you can easily farm up all the things that you need in the game. So, if we just farm up a bunch of these trees, we should get a little bit... How much do we need? I don't know. Probably maybe like 13-ish things of wood. Because once we get all of the wood, we can turn it into planks and sticks and be able to make tools out of all of that. I also need to find like a home base area so that I can make up... Oh, all the things fall. Okay, I didn't do that in the other tree. Burr, 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 burr. Dur, 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 dur. Getting all the stuff that we need. Okay, so after this tree, we should have enough to be able to do the things that we need. Now I am playing on a server with some friends, and they've been playing on this for a lot, lot longer than I have. So they have like just a ton of stuff, but I didn't. I'm not gonna ask for help. I want to learn how to play this game on my own. So, okay, we should have enough for all the things that we need. Now we just need to find a place where we want to live, because I don't want to go in the dark. Is this stuff for pickaxe? Okay, no. We need. Is this? I think this is somebody else's house. Now, the one thing I do know is that baddies can spawn no matter what time of the day, anywhere that it's dark. Oh wow, they've built a ton of stuff. So let's get away from their base. Leave them to their own thing. I thought you could sprint in this game. Can I not sprint? I thought it was like double tapping the forward button. I guess that's not the case. I'll figure it out. So um, I need food, but I can't seem to eat mushrooms. I'm still going to keep collecting them just in case they're useful in the future. So we have to hang out near all these. Maybe stuff won't spawn. What is that? Is that an octopus? That's... Oh, those are creepy looking. Am I going to die if I go near them? Probably. <laughs> Let's just focus on the beginnings of the game first before we start going a little cray cray trying to kill everything. Look at the duck! The, uh, oh, what the hell was that? Something went bleh at me. Okay, this is another person's base. What am I? What am I to do? Do I just go into their base? Will I die if I go in their base? That's the question. So I am farming up some sand because, or not sand, dirt, so that I can build my house once I get somewhere where I can build. I think we're gonna trespass. Can I? Tr oh. <laughs> Maybe not. Okay. So I spent a little bit of time exploring, and I found this island that's got a lot of high ground on it. I think I'm gonna claim it as my own for now. I kind of, I am a little close to this dude. He's <laughs> got a look at that structure way in the distance. That's insane. So I'm a little close to people, but it's not bad. And it's getting dark, so that's not good. So we need to build things to not die. Um, so we need to build a little house really quick or we're gonna die and birch wood is really hard to really hard to cut up that's good to know okay we're gonna just do this real quick let's place let's make a little house like right there yeah just like that eh. 
I don't know if I have enough to do this, but next I only have 17 blocks. Oh God. Just need a little shelter to keep out the baddies. Oh God. Oh, this is not going to end well. <laughs> I'm going to die. How much you want to bet I'm going to die? Oh, we're out of stuff. That's not good. Okay, let's take this and this and then place you there and there. Oh, God. You're in the wrong spot, bud. Eh, go there. That can go there. We need more. We need more. We need all sorts of more. All right, so we're going to make this just a little bit deeper, maybe. Maybe that'll help. We got some stone down there. That's good. Maybe we keep digging down. I need some light. I need coal is what I need. So the goal of the first night is just to make somewhere where you can hide. That is the gist of every survival game. And this is just a survival game. So think of it like a survival game and we should be able to survive. Now, I don't know how to build a roof. That might pose some issues. I did collect some wood. So let's go ahead and open up our inventory. And if we put that in there, no, if we do that that whoa what's this no 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 let's stop doing that yeah we want to build those yes so that's what we're gonna do do this this how do we how do we make you make more of these so i'm not an expert okay so there we go got a whole bunch of that there we go and now if we put the planks in there we should no that's not what we want oh a button the hell's a button? We don't want a button. Boop, 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 boop. What's this do? Nothing? Okay. We want to make some tools. But now I have to remember how to make a tool. Let's see here. So we put, should be able to put that in there. In there. Sticks. There we go. That's what we wanted to do. So you put them in a line and you make sticks. So there's four sticks. We're going to do that a few times, I guess. Damn. Okay. Yeah. So when you put that in there, we'll make a whole bunch of these sticks. We'll make more of those. There we go. That should be good. And you right click to make a whole bunch of them. There we go. Put those back in the stack. That can go back in the stack. And now we need to make a table. Oh, it's terrible. We're dying. They came in the base. What are they doing? Let's just let them shoot at each other. Maybe they'll just die by themselves away from me. <laughs> they came out of nowhere. Okay, they're doing their own thing. I just kind of got in the way. So I'm going to hide like y'all. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, one's down. Can I steal their arrows? Well, okay. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> All right. So we have made the crafting station. Just so you, I'll show you guys how to make it real quick. What you do to make the crafting station is you get two of these woods together. And then you go like that. Whoops. Like that. And then like that. And it makes that. And you bring that down here. And then you would put it back in here and it'll make a crafting station. Since I already did it. Crafting table. Then you do that and it makes a crafting station. Too easy. Now what you do with the crafting station is we're going to put it right here. And then we got to get into it. So now what we can do is we can use these sticks. Whoops. If you draw it out in the pattern that you want, like a that, and then do this. And we've made an axe, so we can bring the axe down here. And then we do this, we can make a shovel. Too easy. So we've got an axe, a shovel. Now we should probably have... we got a pickaxe and a shovel. Now we should probably have an actual hatchet of sorts. There we go, like that. What else could we use? Oh, a sword. So if we do that, and then there, and then we make a sword. 
Now I've got one torch, which is going to come in handy, and I've got a whole bunch of dirt. So we're going to start making our house. I don't know how to make a ceiling. <laughs> we're going to have to figure that one out. Okay. But anyways, I'm pretty, actually, I do know how to make a ceiling. So we'll do that. Now we can actually chop down this tree effectively. Actually, if we use the actual wooden axe. All right, so we've got our base going. It is dark out. We've got our friendly chicken, Wilson, hanging out with us. And to do the roof, you just do that. I'm hoping it won't create it too dark in here so that something will come and try and eat my soul. So I'm going to leave it like that and just hope that we can make it through the night like this with just that little bit of light. But yeah, this is our home. Home sweet home. It's not the best home. <laughs> but we're going to survive this time. Because we can easily just close ourselves in and we won't die. The night is dark and full of terrors. Oh, that was a rough night. I thought it was daylight, so I jumped out and there were spiders all over the place. Killed the spiders. And then there was this guy, I hit him and he exploded and blew up my base, but he did uncover some coal there. So I'm gonna use... Oh, that's some scary noises. I'm gonna use the coal to make... There we go, now we can eat some meat. Use the coal to make more torches for tonight, which will be very, very good. Let's see here. So we can go ahead and eat the raw chicken, which doesn't sound good, but it will give us some health. Correct? Right? No, can we? There we go. Nom, nom, nom. Okay, there we go. Got a little bit of health back. Things are not looking good for us, though. So let's go ahead and get this coal. Give me the coal. Thank you. You're a scholar and a gentleman, Cole. So now I can actually make... Ooh, there's more coal. Even better. So if I keep mining this coal, I'll be able to make a whole bunch of torches for tonight so that we won't encounter the same problems we just encountered. Okay, so we seem to have a rogue spider around here somewhere. I spawned it because when I dug down a little bit deeper, I accidentally dug into a cave and I think I pissed some stuff off. So, n that noted... I am gonna. Sh I did dig up a whole bunch of coal. Yeah. So we're gonna put the stick there, some coal there, and uh oh, uh oh, don't pick that all up. Pick it all up. Okay, I thought the spider was here because I'm very, very close to death, like insanely close to death. I don't know how it's walking around during the daylight. There it is. Shit. Oh god. Ah! Kill it. Kill it. Whoo. Oh. Oh, see? Ninja spiders, man. Holy crap -o. Okay. Whew. Damn, ninja spiders. Almost got me. Okay, we got... We got some of these. So we're gonna go ahead and put some torches in our house. So I'm gonna put one there. Let's put one there. One there. And one there. There we go. So now we should be able to... Boink, boink. Boink, boink. Put our roof on here. Stupid ninja spiders scaring the crap out of me. Yeah. So we dug a little bit deeper. We're making a little cave house, which I am okay with. Because it seems safe. Except for the cave under me. I imagine that could pose an issue later on. Whoa, hello, weird noises. You need to be making weird noises in my ear. So I made it through another night. Not really, though, because I died. Because even though it was daylight, we did technically make it through another night. The fact is, I went outside, and for some reason it spawned something, and since I had absolutely no health, I died. But we're back, and we're going to make a bow and arrow think. Yes, we did it. We're amazing. Super freaking awesome. Now if we just figure out how to make some arrows. I saw arrows in this little list. Arrows. Okay, we don't have any of that stuff, do we? Oh, jeez. Okay. So we don't have enough feathers for arrows yet, but at least we have a bow, and we've got this. So we should be good. I did upgrade all of the tools while we were waiting for the night to go as well. Why this axe is the thing it's supposed to be used for this takes far longer than anything else. Oh, because it cuts down the entire tree. That's cool. I didn't know that. 
So if you use it from the bottom, it should cut down the entire tree. That's amazing! Okay, so that makes life so much easier. Anyways, guys, that is it for this first episode. I am going to be making a lot more episodes of Minecraft Feed the Beast. This is supposed to be an awesome mod pack. If you guys want to check it out, I'll provide a link below for all the information on installing the um, Feed the Beast mod. I know I really didn't show anything off from the mod itself. But as always, if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And if you like the video, don't forget to hit the like button. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye. Everything changes. Let's do it. Screw it. YOLO. I'm stuck. I'm stuck on a tree. 45,000 damage per hit. We got a whole bunch of alphas here. Ooh. Okay, he only does 4.7 thousand damage per hit. But also, my damage seems to have decreased significantly.